Hi, welcome to Robojax. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the touch, the relay and Arduino to turn the AC or DC light like this on when you touch it like this. And then when you touch it again, it goes off and it stays off. When you touch it, it's on. And when you touch it again, it goes off. So let me explain the code. The code will be provided at the description, which you click and go to robojax.com slash learn slash Arduino. So this is the TTP223. This is the touch module from this side. This is the touch area. I've uh, soldered it in this way, but you can solder it the other way. So when you insert it. So we have here three pins. So one is VCC. This goes to five volts. It can work from 3.3 to five volts. And this, the last one is for the ground. And this is the data output. We also have an LED here. When you touch it, the LED will be on. So here are the three pins. So this goes to VCC, this goes to the ground. And then the middle one is the data out, which you connect it to pin two. Let me explain the relay now. The relay is five volts, so we do need other external power, so it can be powered with the Arduino. So we have three connections here. So this is common, so you always connect your one of the wires that you connect to AC or DC, whatever, heater, light, whatever, so you connect it, the light is connected here, one of them, and the other one will be either connected here or here, depending on the application. So this means normally connected, so without any power to this, it's always connected. If you connect another wire here, the, so it will be connected, and your device will have power. And this is normally open, so when you connect the, the middle here and the other one is here, it will be normally open. When the relay energizes or get signal, this will connect these two wires. Uh, we have two uh, LEDs here. This red LED is for uh, when it gets power, and then this will activate it when it gets signal. So the three inputs or the three pin for the uh, relay or VCC, so this is VCC and this is ground, so you will connect this to 5 volt and this is connected to the ground or negative wire. And this is input. The input is where the signal comes. This is connected to the pin 10 in this uh, application. When the signal comes, this light will be on. Panel has brown and green, so this VCC is connected to the 5 volts here. I have 5 volts. So that's, that's connected, and the brown is connected to the ground, to this ground here. Out pin is connected to the pin 2 here. And then from the relay also, this is connected to the 5 volts, and then the ground is connected to the ground. So we have two grounds here and two 5 volt, one 5 volt, another. If you don't have two 5 volts in your Arduino, just use another uh, breadboard or just set one of these pins as an output and make it high. So now the the end pin of this one, which is the input for the relay, this is connected to the pin 10. So let me explain the AC bulb here. So this is a table light that is connected to the wall outlet and then the wire goes and will be turned on. But I have disconnected one of these two wires here. So let me show you. So I've just cut this wire from here. Now this can be connected to the uh, relay. The relay job is to just connect it so it will be on and disconnected will be off. I've just twisted them and then put some solder so this can be inserted into a uh, connector with a screw. Now I have connected the AC wires between the common and normally open in O. So here is the code. Pin 2 is defined as an input pin for the touch panel, and then relay is connected to the pin 10. So these two, you can change it accordingly if you're connecting it to a different pin, but these three value, the val is the touch value from pin 2, and then this is a light on, another variable that shows the status of light, and then touch, which shows the status of touch, you do not change these. If you're playing, play with those two. And then we have inside setup from here to here. We have just three lines. So we have serial begin, which defines 9600 baud for the serial printer, so it can print the data here. And then we have touch pin, which is 
above it will be here and defined as an input and relay pin defined as an output relay pin is mentioned here which is pin 10 and then we have inside the loop we are getting the touch pin which is 2 and then we are reading the result and storing it in a this variable called val and then we have f condition which is from here to here inside f we say if val is high which means if it has been touched and if the light is equal low which means light is off then touched is the touched variable which we have touched status 1 minus touched and then we set the delay equal 100 so we just wait one tenth of a second and after this whatever is the light on for the light on we just set the value whatever is the value if this has been touched we just set it there then here we say if touched is equal high then we say light on put this in here and also pen relay pin to low this relay that I have will be activated when the pin is low otherwise or else light off which is now it's printing and relay pin high after that it just with 100 millisecond which is one tenth of a second and then it prints this this is just printing an extra uh, space here for us so if you want we can just delete it and as I touch you see on this side it says light on and when I touch it says light off so this is how it works very easily thank you for watching this was how you can turn the light on with a touch and keep it on and uh, when you touch it again it goes off this can be applied to other applications you can just modify the code to make it work for something else so if you like the video please thumb up and also please share it if you want to get updates of my video please subscribe i appreciate it